Delusional Designs, George here today. Uh, we are going to do a little work in Inkscape. Um, today, customer asked me to do a, how do we do a 34 inch diameter circle with a 3 16 by 2 slot every 2 inches around uh, the circumference of it. So, uh, today we're going to end up using our alignment tools okay which is shift control a our manipulate tools which is control uh, shift control m and our snap tools uh, which we have turned on over here i'm going to use the snap to midpoint and snap to center uh, so one of the first things i did is i went ahead and just drew the 34 inch circle um, next i had put a small circle in the center there um, which is like 0 0.02 diameter uh, then I just aligned that on center. Uh, next I had drawn a 4 inch by 3 16 square rectangle and just drag that to uh, center. Now it's going to center on the midpoint and on the edge here. Uh, if I click this twice uh, I get my little uh, alignment uh, rotate point here. Okay, I'm just going to drag that roughly to the center and uh, I want to center it right on my uh, midpoint piece that I put here. Uh, that's why I put that little dot. So uh, let's just zoom in a little bit so I can see that better. So you can see now I'm pretty much centered on this uh, spot for my rotate point. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do, just hit Control D, um, and then uh, we took our diameter and multiplied it by pi which is 3.14 um, then divided that by 2 because that's how many inches gap we want to have here between these uh, and I took that number and then I divided 360 for 360 degrees by that number which gave us 6.72 for our rotation so uh, I, I've already duplicated this I just need to apply and I can just uh, keep doing this all the way around and this is going to give me two inch spacing on these. Uh, I went with a four inch uh, piece instead of just doing a two inch uh, and lining up the edge because uh, you need to have some overlap when you want to have things properly uh, union or difference from each other. So uh, that is the whole idea is just to be able to uh, union and difference. Uh, properly so uh, so I'm just gonna go around here let's keep doing a control D and I know there's some softwares that'll do this part of it a little quicker uh, and a little seem like a little easier however all they will do is a rotation uh, a circular array uh, they have no option to do a um, offset so like we could have got done here and we could have done 10 uh, degrees of angle for our last one which would be similar to what a flywheel bolt pattern uh, would have had uh, so uh, you know just something that uh, uh, to note so we are not gonna need our um, little center circle anymore which of course so small I can barely find it so so I'm just gonna delete that center circle uh, I want to make all of these outer pieces into a piece we're also not gonna need to have our center there so I'm just doing control K for those grab the circle grab these and just do the control minus and now we have a perfectly spaced um, two inches on center to these uh, slots so uh, hopefully this helped you guys uh, if you get any other uh, oddball requests on how to do something um, you know let me know and uh, we'll see if we can make a video of it thanks guys